Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So, I have an update on the EK, my EK sedan, my daily. I traded that to my buddy. Who had a car I've always wanted to own. And I finally got it. It is a 94 Honda Civic hatchback. It's actually pretty, it's pretty clean. I mean, it came from California. It has the aftermarket wheels, coilovers, carbon fiber hood, which I'll show you in a second, carbon fiber duckbill wing. I mean, they replaced the rust and primed that area where they cut it out and put a new quarter in. It did come from California. I mean, this thing is gutted. It's beautiful. I mean, everything works on it though. Um, I did put LED tag lights, LED brake lights in it. Me, with the help of my daughter and my fiance, we lowered it more. It just looks like it's lowered different because of the ground. This is the fender off of my EG coupe I got from James D guy, my brother. By the way, I'm the one editing this video. Wow. And on his video, you'll see a video of him painting this. And I mean, it's been like six months, almost seven months, and it's still beautiful. Turned out great. This fender was shitty when I got it, or the fender that was on the car was pretty shitty. So I replaced that. I put new corner lights in. Um, the, it actually has fog lights and all the wiring on it. So I'm going to see if I can't get those to work. If not, I'm just going to rip them out and sell them. I personally don't like the way they look. Carbon fiber hood's pretty. <laughs> Clear coat's pretty faded. And it looked like someone tried to flake it off. But um, in a video, I'll be wet sanding this whole entire thing and reshooting the clear on it. To get the natural carbon fiber look back. Um, it does have a B20B in it. A JDM B20B. See if I can't get that to focus right. Yeah, B20B. DC sport headers. I mean, it has the BDL throttle body, AEM fuel rail. So, yeah, I mean, um, innovative solid mounts. So, it has work done to it, that's for sure. That's one of the reasons I got it, and I've always loved hatches. I'll be replacing this fender before paint. Other than that, I'll have a video in the future of my buddy and I painting this. I'm thinking it's probably just going to go to the original color, the original black, and with some type of flake. Let's see if I can't get that. Yeah, I mean, the original color. Door jams are still black, so... Might as well sand it and repaint it. Not a bad little car at all. I mean, it has the full swap. I mean, the everything from the swap is original to that swap. I'll be putting door panels, carpet, and the center console back in it. I'll be leaving the rear gutted. But down below, let me know what you guys think of it. I mean, I think it was a pretty damn good trade. My buddy wanted a four-door daily. I wanted in the hatch. So, I got the hatch I wanted. But, leave a comment below what you guys think. What do you guys think I should do with it next? Um, don't forget to subscribe. Hit that button. So you get notifications whenever I upload new videos of the new project car. And, hit the like button. Also, my brother has two channels he has a texas honda channel the link will be in below go subscribe check out the videos he's doing a ek coupe um and in, uh, in memory of our buddy that passed away last year so go check that out um he has some pretty good content on there and also more motorsports he has he has damn good content on that too he actually has a video of how you can paint your fender to with rattle can to look like that beautiful 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 but yeah guys make sure to check his channels out i'll put the links below and have a great day and god bless stay tuned for more videos on my coop